Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick9G. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to be talking about the 1970s television show, Emergency. I want to thank all of you for supporting the channel by subscribing, liking, and commenting. Now, if you're a fan of Emergency and other classic TV shows, check out my channel, browse, and also check out my playlist of Emergency for more videos, which I think you will absolutely enjoy. Now, in today's video, I'm going to talk about a specific blooper. Now, according to the definition, a blooper is just any embarrassing mistake. So we're going to be definitely looking at a really funny, embarrassing mistake from season two. Now, it's the first episode of season two. It's called Problem. Now, if you remember the show, they had about an hour long episodes if you do count commercials as well. And so a lot of things happen in this episode for one. Both Roy and John rescue a man who is injured while repairing his car. In fact, the whole engine falls on top of him. But when the radio in the ambulance is broken, Roy treats him without any medical authorization, which is, of course, a no-no. Now, this act infuriates the man's personal physician, played by the awesome Lloyd Bachner. If he looks familiar to you, he is from Columbo, but also the main guy from the Twilight Zone episode to serve man, which I think a lot of you know about. Now getting back to the episode, this doctor is upset and it causes Dr. Brackett and Nurse McCall to come into Roy's defense. Now, one of the things that I really like about this episode is that it's everywhere. It starts at the station, then it goes to this accident where the mechanic has the engine fall on him. They go to the hospital. Then they also go kind of to a ranch or this type of grass area where there's a bull and there's of course an emergency there. Then they head back to the hospital. Then they go back to the station. They're just all over the place. There's even a five alarm fire during this. But as I mentioned, Roy was having some issues. He was having trouble sleeping at night. And this is where we find this blooper. Now, when you see it, I don't know. I really want to know your thoughts down below what you think about it. Roy gets up in quote unquote the middle of the night before heading to that fire. He puts his kind of fire uniform on, he puts his boots and his overalls on, and he kind of walks to a mirror down the hallway corridor and to a mirror. However, if you look on the right hand side, I'll highlight it for you right here. There is a guy staring at him in the reflection. Now it's kind of creepy. There is a moment like this on Gilligan's Island, which there's an eighth person watching the rest of the people on the island, which is really, really creepy. Uh, but I would say this is kind of creepy as well. But I know a lot of you will say, well, no, this is just one of the other firefighters. It still makes it creepy. Um, of course, wearing that blue colored shirt. However, if you look at quickly into the next scene, the alarm rings and they're all sleeping. They're all wearing white. So it was definitely not one of the men in the firehouse. This is someone from, of course, the staff or someone just on the crew while they were filming this who appeared. It's really strange. It's really weird. I'll leave it for you on here. I want to know your thoughts. Did you notice this when you're watching this episode? Let me know if you want to see more bloopers, more fun things just like this and more on the show emergency. Let me know by hitting the thumbs up button and by subscribing. We'll see you next time. And don't forget guys and gals, be hopeful. Thank you so much to all my supporters on Patreon, especially my diamond tier patrons. Tommy G, Citizen Kane 359, Grace U, Sally N, David D, and Ricky. You can find exclusive content on Patreon at different tiers. Go ahead and check it out and thank you so much.